everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be sharing with you guys some summer essentials that I absolutely have to have during the summer from Trader Joe's. And I'm, this is just the start of it. You'll see throughout the weeks as summer you know, starts picking up, it's getting hotter. You'll probably see more items that I love and also some new stuff that might be coming in every week. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started with this video. Here is my summer seasonal must-haves, well, some of them. So let's start it off with these two cereals. Now, I ate so much of this peanut butter puffin cereal and the banana nut cluster cereal when I was pregnant. I literally ate this every single day. And for some reason, during the summer, cereal just sounds so good. It's probably because it's hot and you have, like, nice cold milk that you add in your cereal. But... The reason I like this is because I actually mix the two. So I always do about two thirds of the peanut butter puffin cereal and top it with this banana nut cluster cereal. The banana nut cluster cereal is amazing if you like bananas. It's just the perfect topping to go with this peanut butter one because bananas and peanut butter go together like peanut butter and jelly. <laughs> Moving on, I got these brand new peanut butter cartwheel cookies. These look so great. I am so stoked to try these. These are peanut butter cookies filled with creamy peanut butter. I also got this new chocolate covered wafer cookie. Um, it's kind of like a Kit Kat bar. And then another new sweets item, which are these bite-sized crispy cookies filled with Belgian chocolate. I mean, how could I say no? These look super yummy. I think I might try one of these with my mid-afternoon coffee because the combination just yum. Um, I also picked up some more soft licorice twists in the berry flavor. Uh, these are just screaming summer to me and my husband and I have just become obsessed. I had to get my soft and juicy mandarins because I think I told you guys in either my last haul or the haul before, these are like such a summer, just delicious, yummy, juicy treat to have whenever you want something that's a little sweet and is a little chewy. This is a great little snack to have. I also got this soap. This isn't new. It's been around for a couple months, but it's the pink pomelo grapefruit hand soap. This stuff smells so good. I had to get some um, because I wanted it for my kitchen. I am super pumped that we got this back. This has been out of stock at my store for a little while. I think it just sells really well. I had to get the olive oil potato chips. You guys know. I don't even have to say anymore. Yes, those are fave. I also picked up a second bag of the spicy cheese crunchies. I am obsessed with these. These are actually so much better than spicy Cheetos in my opinion because they aren't as spicy and they have a lot more flavor. So you're not just burning your tongue off and not being able to taste anything for like a couple minutes. These are actually really good. So I picked some of these up and I thought these would go really good with an ice cold beer or like a nice margarita. I also was running low on my grapeseed oil, so I picked up some more of this because I know you're not supposed to cook with olive oil on high heat, so I've been using the grapeseed oil to do any like stir fries or anything that requires like a higher heat, and I actually love this. It doesn't really have a flavor, so it, you know, it goes with anything pretty much. Okay, I also picked up my favorite organic olive oil tortillas or wheat wraps. Um, I think these are perfect for just throwing together a wrap with some of the microgreens that Trader Joe's sells. Yeah, like microgreens, tomato, avocado, onion, like a ton of stuff that I like, just veggies in a wrap, and I just wrap it up, and sometimes I'll even put like a dressing in there just to give it a little bit of flavor. But these wraps really go well with like anything. You guys can make quesadillas, you can make burritos, sandwich wraps, whatever you want. Moving on here, I got some berries because nothing is more summer than berries. And these are just coming in beautifully. Like They look and smell amazing. This is my third clamshell of these large organic strawberries. These are two pounds. And then I also got some delicious ripe raspberries, some blueberries, and green grapes. My son is like obsessed with these green grapes lately. He he wants them for every single meal, but he's also been just loving all of the berries. So I really get these for his meals 
Um, and I also, I cut up a bunch of strawberries usually and just put them in a bowl and snack on them throughout the day whenever I'm hungry. Um, I also got this new organic Caesar salad kit. This is the third time I've bought this because it's amazing. It has um, pretty much everything in the kit that you need to make the salad. And the reason I love this is because as a vegetarian, it's really hard to find a Caesar salad kit or a Caesar salad in general that doesn't have anchovies in it. So I love this because there is no uh, anchovies in it. So it is vegetarian. And again, these salad kits come with, I don't know if you guys can tell, but inside there is a bag with the dressing, the croutons, and the cheese all in separate bags so that you can add that to your salad. So a lot of times I will only make half of this and then I will save the other half. And so it makes it very convenient to be able to save the dressing, cheese, and croutons um, separately so that the salad doesn't make everything soggy. And obviously when you add dressing to a salad, it doesn't really save after that. So if you guys like Caesar, check this one out. It's really good. I also got my fave Southwest chopped salad. Um, again, this is the same type of salad kit where it has like the individually wrapped um, tortilla chips, like the strips, tortilla strips, pepitas, um, the dressing, and the cheese. So I love this. I get this all the time, and I always make a half of it for myself and the other half for my husband for dinner a lot of times because it's just an easy go-to, and it's delicious. So, yeah. Also got this brand new almond cashew macadamia nut beverage. I'm super stoked on this. This looks amazing. As you guys who watch my videos know, I don't drink milk, so I'm excited to try this. And I love this because there's only 30 calories in it, and there's four servings, so you guys can see. And this comes on the shelf. It's not refrigerated. So, um, yeah, if you guys are looking for it, just look where all your... Um, shelf stable almond and coconut milks are and it should be with the rest of those items. Also had to pick up the chicken sausage breakfast burrito for my husband and the black bean and cheese burrito for either myself or my son, whoever is digging it <laughs> at the time. Gotta get the lemon elderflower soda. I just made these amazing drinks with this. I added a can of this with some vodka, sparkling water, and a squeeze of a half a lemon, and it was amazing. Oh my gosh, so good and so refreshing for summer. If you guys just wanna have like a chill summer cocktail, this um, recipe that I made was like amazing, and I just winged it, and it turned out great, so. That is a little tip for you guys if you guys um, like really refreshing, lemony flavored drinks. This is a great option. And if this is too sweet for you guys, um, I do suggest adding sparkling water because it really tones it down and it's great. I also picked up the Tapas Sampler. This is, um, I've, I've done this in a haul before, so if you guys have seen this, just skip over it. But it comes with three different types of Spanish cheeses. And these are all thinly sliced that peel apart. So you actually take the top one and you peel it back. And you have like a cute little triangle that you can just put on some crackers or just eat by itself. Um, my husband likes to have this just as a snack sometimes. And, you know, you, you got three different flavored cheeses and they peel really nicely and they're thin. So they're perfect for just munching on. Moving on, I got some more perfect bars. I've come to realize that the peanut butter one and the peanut butter chocolate chip one are my favorite ones. Um, and I'm sure you guys know that already. But I always get these. They're perfect for when I work a morning shift. I just eat one of these bars before I get to work, and it just gives me energy throughout my shift. So I love that. Um, also got some fresh squeezed limeade. This is seasonal now. I think this is like one of the best limeades I've ever had. These are so refreshing to have in the summer when you just want something that just like quenches your thirst. This is just perfect for it. You can also make really yummy margaritas with this limeade or daiquiris. I got this brand new rainbow wrap and this screamed summer to me because it is so, look at how cool this is. Look at how colorful. And it just looks super healthy and delicious. It is roasted sweet potato, curried hummus, beet and spinach. And then my husband got the chicken tikka masala. This is a super popular item at Trader Joe's. And it's easy to make. I think you just heat it up in the microwave. But it's chicken and spiced tomato sauce with basmati rice. And then my husband also got this shrimp soft tacos. These, are, these come in frozen, so 
He likes to take these to work, um, and he can just heat them up in the microwave. And he loves these. He eats them all the time. I also got the brand new Gone Berry Crazy chocolate covered strawberries. Um, yes, please. These are probably going to be a staple in our house. And I'm going to be very sad when they go away because these are a seasonal summer product as well. These are frozen, so you just pop them in your freezer and grab them whenever you feel like a little snack. Trader Joe's also sells the chocolate covered bananas as well. And those are amazing. So I am very sure I'm going to love these too. And then lastly, the organic pesto pizza with tomatoes and broccoli. This pizza is super yummy, it has a lot of veggies on it, so it's super delicious for a hot summer day or if you just don't feel like cooking. And it's a little healthier than other ones as well. Okay, so now that I've done all of my items that I purchased, I am going to share with you guys a few more items that I believe would be perfect for summer. However, I just didn't need to buy them. So I'm going to be on my phone for a for this portion so I can read to you guys all the things that we have and I'll insert photos of each item. The first thing that I wanted to show you guys is the cucumber avocado body butter. I had the opportunity to test this out and it smells amazing. It has the most light scent and it's not overly cucumber um, scented like a lot of you know, sense that you have cucumber in. It's like almost overwhelming. This is super light and just it smells heavenly and once I use up all my other scented lotions I'm definitely going to purchase this but it is only seasonal so make sure if you guys want to get this to get it now now is the time and the next thing is the zinc oxide mineral sunscreen which I'm so excited about because there are so many other chemicals in other sunscreens that are out there and this particular sunscreen is zinc oxide so for those of you that have allergies or are sensitive to other sunscreens I would recommend this one it's new it does come in a spray bottle so it's extra easy to apply I think it's more sensitive for young kids skin as well don't quote me on that always check with your doctor before you guys decide what products to use on your children but um, I do think that it would be a good option if you have sensitivities to other sunscreens. The next item I wanted to share with you guys is the mini raspberry pastries. These are in the frozen section. I believe these are brand new and they are just super cute. There are eight mini pastries that come in this bag and they felt in the bag when I was feeling them, they felt like a good size portion for one person. You could probably have two in a sitting and be completely satisfied. They do have the raspberry filling, so I think they would go well with coffee or you know some eggs or something if you wanted something sweet on the side. Um, also, I think it's perfect for Father's Day if you're doing a brunch. I think these are perfect to just have like a pretty plate of them just sitting and ready to eat. Moving on, the Shooting Star Cookies. These are the most fun cookie. I think Trader Joe's has been selling them now for three years, three or four years, and they are so much fun. I actually, when they first came out with these, I bought some, and we were having a big 4th of July party, and I literally hand-passed out a star to everyone and had them try it because they have pop rocks on them, you guys. Yes, pop rocks. And so when you bite into this chocolatey cookie, you're not expecting like an explosion in your mouth, but that's what you get because... It is covered in Pop Rocks, so it's super fun for kids, and adults love it too. They actually are very tasty as well. So um, I didn't pick any up this time. I may get some right before 4th of July, and again, these are seasonal. They are not around all year long. Another summer essential, I believe, would be our pink lemonade cupcakes. These are year-round. Uh, Trader Joe's sells them all the time, but they are... Just so reminiscent of summer. They have that really pretty pink color. They're perfect for like a baby shower, a wedding shower, any type of um, event that you wanted to have something like pink. You can also add like sprinkles to them if you wanted to decorate them up a little bit more. But just in general, a pink lemonade cupcake is amazing. So if you guys are feeling like something refreshing and sweet, check out these cupcakes. The last item I'm going to be talking about is the jerk chicken thigh skewers with mango chutney. Um, obviously, I haven't tried these because I'm vegetarian, but my husband has, and he absolutely loves these. These are seasonal as well. They're around the summertime, and they come in frozen. 
So they're perfect for like a get together if you're having like an out outdoor barbecue, whatnot. So they're fully cooked, so all you really need to do is reheat them, but they're perfect for like an appetizer because they do come on the skewer. So you can just put them on a plate and they're ready to go. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. It really does help me out to let me know what you guys like seeing. And subscribe to my channel if you have not already. Again, I am doing weekly hauls now, and I also do a cooking video every Friday with a new recipe to look forward to. Um, this Friday, I'm actually making the Meyer lemon cake with my twist, which I'm adding some berries inside and the lemon curd from Trader Joe's um, as the top. So if you guys are interested in seeing that cake, I am going to be making that Friday. So subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video.